So we're just looking at geographically where Zambia is situated. It lies solely uh, within the catchments of the Zimbezi and the Congo River. So perhaps putting it in better stead than a lot of the countries that are experiencing the runoff uh, of these uh, rivers. Uh, what is your sense with regards to how Zambia is actually utilizing this water resource and how it's actually benefiting those that are living in the country? Yeah, um, yes, you are right. Uh, Zambia is sitting uh, right on two uh, river basins, uh, Zambezi River Basin and uh, uh, Congo River Basin. Um, of course, um, uh, we are utilizing uh, some of the water resources mainly uh, in the agriculture, uh, also for hydropower, uh, at, at least 42% of our water flows uh, within the surface water realm, uh, they are utilized for uh, hydropower. Professor, if we could just talk, I mean, with regards to agriculture, we know that agriculture is, uh, absorbs quite a bit of water and we know that per uh, water unit that is used in agriculture, the economic impact, they say, is not large enough. Uh, this at least is what we're experiencing here in the likes of, of South Africa. Give us an indication of how it is utilized in Zambia and whether you feel that there is uh, enough economic bang for every uh, water unit that is required in agriculture. Um, I would say... Uh, of course, uh, in, uh, for agriculture, uh, particularly uh, on the uh, sugar cane, uh, we have some of the uh, large plantations on sugar um, uh, in the uh, uh, southern Zambia. Uh, so uh, some of the water is used in that irrigation for the sugar cane. Uh, we also have uh, commercial farms that are utilizing some of these uh, water resources for wheat, uh, uh, for uh, maize, that is corn, uh, which is our staple food. Uh, yes, uh, it's being utilized for that purpose as well. With regards to the uneven distribution of water resources uh, within the country, it, it is said that we're not actually seeing enough poverty alleviation. It's not uh, creating enough uh, offtake with regards to what we could see in various uh, parts of the economy. Do you agree with this? And what do you think from a policy perspective could rectify this water sharing issue? Yes. Um, <clears throat> what I, I, I think that uh, Zambia should invest in infrastructure. Uh, that is the, uh, our main concern, uh, infrastructure for uh, irrigation, um, infrastructure uh, for other uses, uh, like harvesting some of the, uh, the flows that take place uh, during this time of the year when we are uh, almost close to the end of the rain season. Uh, if this water is harvested uh, in the, uh, putting up uh, uh, small dams and uh, some reservoirs here and there, that can capture this water so that uh, some of this water can be used uh, uh, in uh, drought years. Uh, and then Zambia would be in the foremost uh, help uh, to utilize some of this water for poverty mm. alleviation. Uh, uh, we need to go down uh, to the level of the subsistence farmer uh, if they can be assisted to put in these small scale, uh, uh, small scale dams that can be used where the farmer can tap water. Uh, for growing even uh, uh, small things like uh, 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 vegetables uh, for in their gardens. Yeah. That will help uh, poverty alleviation. Uh, there's also another issue when it comes to pollution within uh, the copper belt, and we're actually starting to see this being, uh, you know, affecting the quality of the water, uh, especially when we look at the Kafu River, uh, quality issues emanating from there. What is your sense on this? Do you think that uh, enough is being done by copper producers? Um, yes, there, there have been some concerns here and there, uh, but uh, what uh, uh, we know is that, um, you know, uh, there has been this flushing out. Uh, during the rain season, uh, what happens is that uh, uh, some of the issues that may come in terms of water quality, uh, pollution and stuff like that, uh, during the rain season, there is this flushing out, dilution that takes place, uh, and that helps. Uh, to reduce uh, some of the levels that uh, people have uh, gotten concerned yeah. with. Uh, but overall, uh, overall, uh, the water quality in Zambia uh, is generally good. 